a lot of you guys may not know, but Let's Wine About It is a welcoming platform for all. You don't have to have a huge following, a large mansion, and millions of dollars, but you do have to have a liver to drink some wine. Today is the sixth episode of our new series where we welcome in growing entrepreneurs with wide welcoming arms. This is Let's Wine About It, the Entrepreneur Series. On today's episode of Let's Wine About the Entrepreneur Series, we have a very special guest. This guest has been on her entrepreneur ball since 2018. She can do the hell out of some nails, but you, it don't stop there. She has over 20 different shades of lipstick and 15 different lip glosses to choose from. She make her own press songs, and they are beautiful than ever. <laughs> That was what? No, 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 no. I ain't done. I got so much time. <laughs> With that being said, everybody help me welcome the Glam Trap. Thank you. How you doing? I am good. How are you? I'm good. How was your week? But first, <laughs> let's <laughs> <I'm laughs> about it. Let me listen. I, I'm going to hear about your week. How was your week? So, my week was. um. Very challenging. However, mm. I, I, I never back down from a challenge. Oh, so yeah. yeah it was, you know, it was one of those weeks, but I'm here. Mm. And uh, it didn't stop nothing, so. Well, it's good to have you here. It's good thank to, you. it's good you came to whine about it with me. Yes, thank you for having me. No problem. Go grab me a little bit. As I pick my glass. <laughs> this is perfect. <laughs> oh. Let me know it stopped. <clears throat> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, she's just like me. I yes. Know this Come on. Maybe now. you better be careful with that sub home, because that sub home make you go to your up home. <laughs> Look, I ain't going nowhere but home after that. That's okay. <laughs> so, um, on this podcast, we may ask questions that may make you laugh and make you cry. And some questions may even leave you in thought. But we're going to whine about it. Let's do it. Let's do it. So the first question I have for you is, where are you from and where did you grow up? So where I'm from and where I grew up, Funky mm -hmm. Town, Fort Worth, Texas, not to be confused with Dallas, no shade, no tea, okay. uh, but it is Fort Worth on me. And uh, that's where I grew up. That's my home still. You know, I may venture out and do a little bit more of, you know, bi-coastal living, mm -hmm. but Fort Worth is home. Okay, okay. How was it growing up in Fort Worth? It was... It was cool. It was cool. You know, I have plenty of family there, plenty of mm -hmm. friends, stuff like that. Um, you know, we we kind of like city country hood mm -hmm. out there. So it was always something going on, always good times and, you know, just pretty much living life and seeing what's happening. Okay. So what year you officially started your brand? I officially started the brand in 2018. Okay. So what made you, what made you start your brand? So... What made me start the brand, I've always been entrepreneur, had entrepreneur spirit. I've always mm. wanted to have a beauty business. Okay. And it was always about hair for me from the very beginning, like as a kid. So I was a hairstylist, cosmetologist, all of that. But I kind of fell out of the motion of doing hair. And nails, of course. I was just going to ask you, did, you did your own nails? I did do my own nails. They are beautiful. Can you show the people? Thank you so much. Yes. Yes. They, yes. yes. I, I can't wait they've to been on about a these. month, but they still Maybe they still they you know they they <laughs> on there. <laughs> That's how you know they were did good. Yeah, were done good. I said did good. What prompted you to start the business and why? Why do what you know? You just told I, I just asked you that. <laughs> no, you worry about it. It's all right. <laughs> what do you enjoy most about your business? Well, what I enjoy most is being able to create and play with makeup. Because I love makeup. Okay, I, you do makeup too. You say makeup. You brought you brought some makeup. I did bring some makeup. Okay, so you why you ain't tell me you do? <laughs> oh, she a jack of all trades. Yeah, yeah. What I tell you, she got everything makeup. So, <laughs> the glam trap is all things oh, glam. Oh, so it's all glam. Yes, Ladies. hair, skin, nails, all of that. Mm mm mm. mm. The glam trap, man. Yes. I know that's right. She gonna trap me and get all my coins. Yeah. <laughs> What is uh, what is your ho hobby in the pu in your pastime? Like, what is one of your hobbies? Doing nails. Doing nails. Yeah, because that nails. that's a passion. You, you know, practice. 
I do practice. And I I feel like on myself, I practice, you know, mm-hmm. but I don't practice a lot. But then I have a daughter. She's 15. So now I get to practice on her because she wanted nails forever. But we have to take our time with that. Yeah. Because she don't look 15. So, oh, okay. you okay. know. But, yeah. So doing nails is my hobby. Um, And just, I like to cook, you know. You know how elite that is? She can go to school with any kind of nails she want to. Any kind of nails. And they ask her, who did your nails? My mama. Yeah, that's how that. That far. In school, like, baby, yeah. you can break. My mama did my nails. Yes. If I only had, if I could only w- had went to school, it was like my dad cut my hair. Yeah. Everybody yeah. would have been gagging. I right? had the first step cut in there. <laughs> what are some ups and downs of being an entrepreneur? So, uh, for sure, ups, of course, is, you know, making somebody smile, yeah. making somebody feel confident. And that was one of the other reasons why I did want to do a makeup line as well is mm-hmm. because I know there's a lot of women, guys, girls, us out there that don't always feel confident or pretty. Yeah, and yeah. I know even though they are, and I mean, I, I'm one of them too. Yeah, so it's like, yeah. hey, when I put a lip on or a <laughs> lash. You see, I'm over here glossed down. You know, it's like, oh, okay, there, that's it. There she goes. Yeah. Okay, I love, you know. So um, th- those are definitely the ups, you know, being able to inspire and, and encourage, you know, people to enhance or embrace their beauty. And I don't think that you guys get enough flowers. Like, I don't think people give y'all enough flowers. Like, y'all do nails. Mm-hmm. The, y'all supply lip gloss, mm-hmm. makeup, mm-hmm. lipstick. All, yeah. Like, yeah, all the ups yeah, yeah, that like, all like. All the enhancements and stuff. Yeah. That people, like, y'all really are a big part of women's nature and now men. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you know? Look, so, come man. on. Look, because, it, it, because the thing is, it's like, you know, being able to just throw something on, mm. you know, or nails done or mm. gloss down, or, you know, because yeah, yeah. when you, it's just something about it. I know for me and I know for other people too that, um, you know, go ahead and get they self together. It, it's, it's a good thing. It's a good feeling. Now, some, a down, you know, of course, could just be the hassle of the, <laughs> of the entrepreneurial ship and, you know, just the, the, the constant hustle and all mm. of the trials that can come through there. But, you know, if it's no down, you can't go up. So. Have you ever had any rude customers? I mean, not really. <laughs> because. You are giving the give. Right on the guilt. Oh, oh yeah. That ain't going to go play with Great you. business. You are giving the give like you would. Yeah. <laughs> and I try to be professional and keep everything, you know. Yeah up and up and and honest and humble with everyone so that way we don't have no misunderstandings because that you know, Baby, we don't want something. that we you look like you were giving together you like you're giving together like a family gathering <laughs> right yeah and 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 kind of you know we oh yeah yeah mm-hmm. <laughs> what do you enjoy most about your business what do you like so i i ain't look because i like to shop so I enjoy when it's time oh, to yeah, yeah. <laughs> restock. I enjoy uh, when there are new products or new things available yeah. because there are a lot of times I have people that ask for certain things yeah, that I don't and carry. Don't have it then. Right. And then that gives me a reason <laughs> to go yeah. for it. So that's one of the things I do enjoy. And then not just that, but just being able again to spread, you know, just positivity and beauty, you know, mm. around the world. Yeah. You run one day. <laughs> Period. Today. And I, and I understand it all hard. Right. Yeah. What are your best selling products? Uh, best selling products. Definitely the lip gloss. As you can see, I have a few here. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. They get that, that lip gloss get gone. Yeah, lip gloss is like, that's one of the best sellers. The lip gloss as well as um, the, the matte lipsticks and the press-ons too. Okay. The press ons they they be gone pretty quick too. So what I try to do now with press ons is just do like mm-hmm. um, custom order mm-hmm. because it takes a lot of work for that. That's why I do have custom orders as well as pre made. So do you make your like not make? Do you um do you tell them they had the well? Do you make them do a deposit? I do. Like if they, I know that's right. Mm-hmm. We're not gonna waste no time. I, we're won't, not gonna do that. Won't be no flaking on me, baby. It won't. <laughs> you know, I mean, because I'd have no problem doing it. Yeah. But hey, <laughs> but I need my money. I need it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What are have you? Oh, 
Oh, okay. Have you collabed with anyone for brands, or do you do brand ambassadors? Like, let the girls, the influencer girls that be watching, do you do brand ambassadors? So, I do do brand ambassadors. Currently, right now, I have two brand ambassadors. Um, one of them, my first brand ambassador, mm -hmm. um, her name is Diamond Carrington Cassidine, or is it Cassidine Carrington? Excuse me. She's going to get me. Diamond Cassidine Carrington mm -hmm. uh, from Chicago. And then her mother, Denasia Bonet Braxton Cassidine. That's my other um, ambassador. Let me be from England. No, uh, 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 matter of fact, Atlanta. <laughs> yeah, um, uh, Denasia, Mother Denasia, she's from Atlanta. Now, I know she's been touring because she's doing some pageants and things right now. Okay. Um, but so I yeah. know that, yeah, that's right. Coming to handy the, uh, the yeah. breast holes and, oh, yeah, I know you. I know and they, they, they and them lips. Mm. Oh, mm. and they can do some lips down. <laughs> I be I love when they put the lipstick on because it's like that's how you supposed to wear it. It's God, honey. Yes. Oh, no. If you could start your business over, what would you do differently? I would do a little bit more research on my vendors and suppliers. A little bit more than what I did starting out because I was burned a few times, unfortunately. But but you know what? You you are a successful business owner, and and you cannot build a resume without experience. That's so true. That's probably a good thing that God gave you the experience. And that is true. And that's why I don't really fret about that because, yeah, like you yeah. say, you know, it's a blessing. It, it is a blessing. Sometimes it can be a blessing uh -huh. and it's a lesson. Like one thing about like starting any type of successful business or yeah. being a business owner, like with any little thing, like you you need those days. You need the, those yes. people that show you that they ain't. Right. Going to be trusted. So yeah. in the future, I don't know how to come on. Exactly. <laughs> and move it on along. Mm -hmm. What's a big challenge to overcome being a business owner? Getting out of your own way. And the, what I mean by that is not letting fear set in or mm. feeling like you're in competition with the next brand mm. because that's not going to get you anywhere. <laughs> and that's something that everybody struggles with. Like, yeah. any type of reason, like, even me as an influencer uh -huh. sometimes, like, it becomes competitive. Like, yeah. when, like, with other, against other influencers, yeah. I'm like, okay, so this bitch gotta accept that to this ceremony. Why they didn't call me? Right. Yeah, I do good just like, like the next person. What happens to oh, yeah, my invite? Yeah, right. It'd it be like that, but <laughs> that just motivates you to go hard. Yeah, like, absolutely. Absolutely. This phone keep like it, so you're gonna. Every time I pause, they wipe her on the battle. <laughs> are you are you looking for new brand ambassadors or a um, new like? Yes, I am. Um, I am looking for new ambassadors. Um, doesn't matter the age, doesn't matter the race, gender. I don't care. Um, so if there is anyone out there interested, please reach out to me, and we can definitely talk. So what are you doing? To, uh, so what was you what would you look for brand ambassadors for? Like, so I would basically look for brand ambassadors. Um, and and you don't have to have a super big following, but if you make content, like I see a lot of people that do makeup videos or mm -hmm. just you know they get ready with me's, you mm -hmm. know. And if I could be a part of that, get ready with me when you finish your face up, yeah. doing your lips or lashes or whatever, mm -hmm. then that will be you know that would be good. That would be good. great, you know. So again, it's just somebody that is interested yeah. in makeup or makeup nails. It doesn't even have to be the makeup part. Nails, uh, the lashes, whatever. But yeah, I'm open for it. What's the biggest risk that you have taken with your bees? Flying to Atlanta. Really? <laughs> you be like... This is one of the biggest risks I've ever taken. And the reason I say it's a risk because I'm by myself here. Oh, and yeah. I've never been... Anywhere by myself because I'm married, been married 22 years. Okay. So I've yeah, never been anywhere okay. without him. And it's like, well, it and it, and it was FaceTiming like all the way down here <laughs> off the plane and everything. Because I'm like, it's different. So I it, just, it was, I know there's like a different experience. Yes, it's a big experience or a big culture shock in a sense as far as me traveling alone. And yeah. it's for my business because I'm going right on back home. I was just going to say, like, do you suffer from separation anxiety? Like, when you go I, I like think that? I do. And, and you know what? Nobody never asked me that. But that yeah. is really true. Because a lot of, like, couples, yeah. like, I can see them, like, not want to be alone. Like, not yes. want to be. Like, even my mom and dad, they've been married, like, the same. Like, mm -hmm. You know, a few years 
and I don't want to tell their age. My mom like, you call my age. But yeah, even <laughs> if they go somewhere, like my mama can't stand to go places yeah. like, oh, 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 oh. It's it's crazy. It, it's I mean, it, it's real, but it's one of those things where I be I went out of town once before in Texas though. I'm all in hotel crying and shit. Could you, you had your hoods with you? I'm ready to go. Yeah. I was in the hospital before at home. And, and I don't think it even had nothing to do with it's just the fact that you know that they right there. Yeah, you know, they, they 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 got you about your side. So. Yeah, and, and, ooh, that's yeah. So it 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 be a little bit of a challenge, <laughs> a little challenge. But I'm big girl. I'm big girl. Yeah, you got these. Yeah. What is your favorite city? Miami. I want to go to Miami so bad. I love. I'm gonna Miami. go soon. I love Miami. Miami is a good getaway. You know, city mm. like just. Not even having to do much. Yeah, it's just, just everything is fun. It's fun. It's just okay, it's, it's, it's just good to get out there and breathe. I'm gonna go out there with me a nest old pair. Hello, come on, shops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where is somewhere you want to visit, like vacation wise, or that you've never been before? And this is this is hopefully coming up really soon. Hint, hint. Uh, <laughs> Puerto Rico. Puerto I want to go on my birthday. My birthday in January, so I'm hoping you to go. On. Aquarius. That's the Capricorn. That's the Capricorn that been hunting me lately. Aquarius, January twenty ninth. So I'm, well, I'm, I'm, I'm like, hoping. You like Aquarius because they always so jolly. Like, well, like y'all about business, yeah. but y'all, y'all can y'all have a smile out of this world. Like you can, like you, you can brighten the room. Appreciate it. Let me see. What did you want to be when you grew up? Like. A hairstylist. Really? Do you do hair too? I don't. I don't. Not any. I do my husband's hair. My my daughter occasionally, but I don't have to really do that anymore because she's learned how to do her own hair too. Really? Yeah. She's in tenth grade cosmetology class, school, and all of that. So, yeah, she's following in the footsteps, and I, and I hope she's a better me. She's already a better me, but I didn't push this her to so do this. Like, I never like, heard. I, you you don't never really hear parents like say I, I hope they're better me. Oh well, yeah, absolutely. oh that that seems so genuine. Like, yeah, I real. really love it. Yeah. What do you see your your business in five years? In five years, on billboards, um, in major stores, mm -hmm. um, having the success that I've dreamt about, you know, and mm -hmm. and and know that's coming. Yeah. So I'm I'm confident in that. So well, I'm I'm here to tell you congratulations more because you are really doing. Good. Thank you so much. And I know your business is gonna. It's, I'm looking for a warehouse. <laughs> Come on, man! <laughs> look, look where we get a warehouse now. Uh, oh, yeah, because they're gonna they're gonna buy it out. Look, so many punks down here with nails on. I'm one of them. Come on with it. I got you. I'm ready for it. I am so ready for it. <laughs> what is the best part about being a business owner? Being able to do what you want to do your way without anybody telling you uh -uh. no or uh -uh. how, yeah, you mm -hmm. know, because I'm the one, uh, no, <laughs> I, I, yeah, 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 I'm no. the adder, yeah, <laughs> <laughs> therefore, so yeah, that that's that's one of the best feelings because it's mine, and can't nobody tell me what the fuck to do, baby. Let me tell you something, one thing about me, I love a boss. And I can tell a boss from a mile away. And right. You are a boss, honey. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much. I appreciate it. What's up next for your brand? So what's up next is I am working on a skincare line mm. now. Um, skincare and I, I hair as well. I already have hair oil. Sorry, I forgot it. But I do have <laughs> hair oil. Okay. Um, so I'm working on that as well as skincare. So I've already started, um, you know, with some sample products mm -hmm. to pretty much see the route that I want to go. But I want to focus on not just making the skin look pretty, but yeah. healthy, skin, he healthy skin, you know, he healthy skin. skin. And then it will, you know, glow and be looking good and things. Okay. Period. Yes. How can people find you if they want to shop with your bees? So you can find me uh, on the website, theglamtrap.net, N-E-T. Um, Instagram, theglamtraptx for Texas. Okay. And then Facebook business page, The Glam Trap. And mm -hmm. I have a nail page as well, Glam Trap Nails on Facebook. Yes, ma'am. Y'all heard it from the Glam Trap, yes. baby. So I'm going to give you 
I, I, need, I need to give you time. I want you to brag on your business. Okay. Like, just brag on your business. Tell the girls what they need. Tell the girls what they need to hear. If they so, want to get beautiful like the glam trap. Yeah, the glam trap is going to get you together, right on together, no matter what. We have 20 plus different shades of lipstick, lip gloss, mm -hmm. nails uh, for the mothers or the workers or the whoever that can't wear nails to work or things like that. We got you set. We have press ons. Now, if you were ever in Fort Worth, you can come through and get your nails done. I got you there too. Okay. Um, we also have blush. We have a blush palette. Of course, that's me on the front, you know, little, 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 one, two, one, two. Okay, um, and then we also have liners. So anything that you need as far as, you know, just quick makeup, you know, products, you know, not necessarily just a whole beat down on the face, but I know me, if I got a lash and a lip, you ain't the dog. I'm straight. Let's go. <laughs> so come so, on and go and get 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 yourself together with the so, trap. What about the girls that love grabbers? So what they call them? Grabbers? Dick grabbers? Uh, what you doing with them? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know what they said, you know. Mm. Okay. Okay, can you give us a demonstration? Like the girls that they want to so, shop and they want to grab. If, if they want to put on some grabbers, how would they be able to grab? If you want like, some grabbers, you know, you'll be able to, you know what I mean? Just, well, you see, well, yeah, something like <laughs> You can grab with one hand. Mm. You can grab with two hands. But they're going to look real good to them when you do. I'm just saying. Her, him, who, pay, whoever. Uh, now that they go now. Uh, <laughs> a little, little reminiscent. I saw him as my husband now. Oh, Lord, see, we got to hurry up and get free of it. <laughs> what is some advice or tips for new entrepreneurs that's just getting started? Do not, number one, do not listen to the naysayers. Uh, anybody telling you, you can't do that. That's too hard. That's too much. It's never too much because the same too much that they're claiming is too much and that you can't do is just enough for somebody else so go ahead and put your two feet mm -hmm. forward mm -hmm. one step two step three step take the steps do whatever it is that you want to do and don't let anybody prevent you stop you hinder you from doing that because it's up here and you know what i hate saying i hate when people be like you do too much or there's too much you're right you, you're not doing a you're Enough. That's why you feel That's, like I do too much. Yeah, because you're doing so. Too little. You know, maybe if you did a little bit more, yes, then you know, yes, be like me, yes. <laughs> but hey, <laughs> everybody ain't built the same. Uh, mm -hmm. But you know, some of us, yeah, we can relate. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yes. So, Fred, I want you to like, I want you to give the girls like, I, I, okay, so we you you bragged on your business. Mm -hmm. You told the girls where they can find you. If the girl, like, you don't offer any nail classes, like... So, I used to offer nail classes. Oh, well, give us the tea. I did used to offer nail classes. Uh, now, though, being that I am in a private location, mm, okay. I can I can open that back up. Okay. So, I do have plans to... Because I had somebody in my inbox the other day wanting a nail nail design class. Yeah. So, because I did nail design. Baby, you better get it. As well as... all these cool. girls' coins. They throwing <laughs> Look, them. You I'm telling them you. Coins. So, I, I will be starting that back. Um, and that as well will be on the website. Everything is on my website. You can book, get your nails done on the website. You can pay for classes. You can pay for ebooks. I have those too. Um, I'm also setting up an academy, which is Major Elite Academy, which is a branch of the Glam Trap, mm. which will have a lot of ebooks, tutorials, and things like that on starting your business, um, picking the right vendors, you know, all that good oh, stuff. That's why I said warehouse. Yes. Yeah. There's a lot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> there's, yeah. There's a lot and, and and I and then it's like it, it, over time I start to realize like damn I got a lot going on. You do, and but I love every moment of it. You I rather it have all. that because everything isn't for everybody. It you know. So the more the merrier. Yeah. Yeah. I want I want to touch somebody everywhere. Yeah, <laughs> you know. Yeah, and, you, and I and I I'm 100 percent behind it. Thank you. Thank you for coming in today. Thank like, you thank for you having for me. Like. Baby, everything is so. Uh, could you hold those those, those the crystals a little less than little teeth? Take them. You, I got you. I got you. I can relate, man. I know it. So we have this one right here is which one is this? Oh yeah, that's this is all hand painted, hand okay. painted and designed by. And me. those are cute. I love those. This, this is a wet color. 
That's the, they call it nude. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, that's the nude. Nude with like a little turquoisey blue, a little hot yellow or lime green. Then we have for the girls who like it simple. You know. Okay. We have just a basic matte set, and they're called my feature right there. And that color is so pretty. And we have all shapes, uh, lengths. So whatever from the coffin, the taper square, stiletto, of course, which is my save. But we, we have them all. So whatever you like, I can custom make them. Uh, that is what you, you will go to the site to put that order in as well as pre-made. Huh? Brent, I want to draw one of your new feet. Well, which one would you like to draw? What, what color do you think they would look good? So it, they are matte. But you got gloss on, so it'll be okay. You can still wear it. Because <laughs> like, like my lips. At, oh, excuse me. As you can see, you don't see. Do you see any? You see some lips? Oh, no. Oh, okay. I know that's right. Come on, come on, visibility. So it don't stain. It doesn't. Now what color little cute? I want to try her out real quick. Okay, let's go. Come on now, give us the Z. We try to see. I want to get into this lipstick boo. Now we have several. Or the gloss. Which one you think will be better? The the stick or the gloss? Which one you want me to put on real quick? You could do you know what? You could do both. Okay. Right. Because that's another thing about makeup. There's no rules. There's no rules. Especially with a lip. You okay. can put a color, whatever color you want on, then put a little touch of gloss. That way it won't be it okay. won't be matte, but at the same time you still got that same color payout. So this color is what I have on. This is and it's cute CEO. This is the color I have on now. That's mm, cute. So let me get you what we got. So that's Glamit or the more to try that you want. Uh, which one? Right here. That one, frappe. Lippy. And then to top it off, we can do either cocoa gloss on top or bombshell. And do I just apply this side? Just, yeah, all you need is that. Now just, uh huh, mix mm. it in. Okay. Mm. Okay. Okay. <laughs> yes. Oh, no. Then. Oh, now, Brian, I look. Now, look. Now, look. <laughs> look. No, that's where gloss come in. So, no. we're going to go with, let's see. Let's go with the cocoa. Okay. And that is a oh, so shade of brown. Uh-huh. Oh, it is the gloss. Uh-huh. And that'll tone it down just a little bit for okay, me. Okay. But it'll still keep the look, the color, and it'll be glossy. I put it on right? Yeah. However you want to put it on, look, I suppose, ain't no rules. However you want to put it on, however you put it on, it's how you do it. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> Let me see. I want to see myself bad. Hold on. <laughs> Not friend. All you need is a liner, though. Hey. Do I got, no, I don't want to give you one of these. It ain't going to work. So, what, so the, so the key too is, look at you. Look like I've been eating chocolate milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> no, look, you can do this though. Now you can blot it. So you need a little piece of paper. It's, 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 also, I go around the lips. So this or just the whole lip. Oh, okay. And blot it. So that way it'll pull off so some of that, that color. Yeah. You give me a little napkin real quick. Boom. It'll pull off some of the color. I want to get this that way. I, leave. I look like, a, like I've been eating um, <laughs> just milkshake. Okay, so I just take that. Uh huh. Now, let me see. Okay, now. There you go. It's built. Now, put the gloss on. Okay, now put the gloss on. Yeah. And see, and that's that's a quick way to fix it is, you know, it ain't, hey, it, it's never a, a right or wrong way. It's just a way to fix it and make it work for you. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Okay. 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 You, gotta, you gotta see it now. You gotta see it now. Now you're together. You're together. That's cute. Mm. <laughs> Okay, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. See, yeah, there you go. And, okay. and, 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 and a little, a little goes a long way, yeah, you know. So, okay, so now they find all plastic with right, you know. You just apply how much, way. yeah. You can apply apply how much ever you want, just to your liking. And so, right. yeah, yeah. And there you go. And that's and that's how you do. It. If if it do come off where it's too much, just blot it like you did. Fix it. Put your gloss on. Set. Rip the. Mm. Rep to go. Mm. Yeah. Any out in there? 
Now let me try my let me try my own my wine. Let's see. Well, you gonna be able to see it because you got the gloss on. But it's, it's just because of the gloss. <laughs> I, I don't have gloss on. Yeah. <laughs> you know the gloss gonna yeah, come off yeah. a little bit. But hey, it's it's like, so cute. It is cute. But yeah, so you can always, like I said, you can play with it. You can make it work however you like. Oh, when it come right off, oh, it don't like. Yeah, especially mm. when you put the gloss on. When you put the gloss on with it, oh, when it come, come right, right off. off. Okay. Yeah, see, mine ain't coming off. <laughs> now, if you want to put it on, on <laughs> it don't want to come this is off. Cute. This is cute. Yeah, but yeah, that's a good little combo. Okay. Um, keep this. That's you. Keep this boo. That's you. <laughs> <laughs> So the glam trail, I just want to say thank you for coming. Today. Absolutely, thank um, you. I pray your business is very much more more successful. Thank you. You have something great going on, and when y'all see the glam trail, y'all make sure y'all shop. Please get your nail done. Yes. Get so your makeup done. Whatever it is, put you your pussy in cheek. Put get everything. Eh, what eh, you kind eh, with? Get eh. your check. Get 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 yeah. your check. Uh, bow. <laughs> get get your check. Uh, uh, how long now? You feeling it? <laughs> yeah. Until next time, this has been Let's Wild About the Entrepreneur Series. I have been your host, Mr. Crying So Bad, and this has been The Glam Trap, Lori. Okay. The Glam Trap. Until CEO. next time, y'all be blessed. Have a good one. And make sure y'all support Lori. Thank you. The Glam Trap. <laughs>